Hi, I'm Izzy Seddon, here for Fresh Business Thinking. We're at the E2E Exchange event at the Four Seasons Park Lane. The ultimate goal of E2E and the thrust of all of this activity and why you're all here tonight is to help make the UK the global epicentre of entrepreneurship. Well, it's great to meet like-minded entrepreneurs, uh, hear what's going on, what's the uh, latest sort of technology people are talking about, uh, what the buzz is around town, and to learn as well. You know, I think as an entrepreneur, you never stop learning. So events like this, I hope I uh, meet a few other great entrepreneurs that can teach me a thing or two. Uh, I think to you know to build my social capital and to get awareness of Love Struck. Plus, obviously, they're, they're very enjoyable. The reason why I attend uh, E2E and also a board member on E2E is because um, I feel it's important for entrepreneurs to share knowledge, ideas. I think the importance of the events like E2E is you get people meeting each other. You know, there's 100% for an entrepreneur or somebody who's got that sort of free thinking mind is enthusiasm. And I think when you come to uh, events like this, you meet people with enthusiasm. One of the challenges again for entrepreneurs is where can I meet people who are like me, like-minded people, and I think what we're trying to do is to get entrepreneurs working together and um, by building this network of people we can give them much gr uh, greater access to the kind of attributes that they need to grow their business. Britain is very well placed, we have a fantastic education system, believe it or not, we have some of the world's best universities still. Um, we have got creative entrepreneurial instincts from old but it's still there, we've invented half the, half the real things in the world came from these shores um, and it's in our, it's in our DNA and I, I really do believe that things are changing. I think, you know, events like tonight, you know, e national receptions, I think, you know, it gives you a great opportunity to talk to other people. There's so many interesting businesses here. Entrepreneurship in the UK has grown hugely. It's now a, a subject uh, that people talk about at school. I'm a role model in uh, Welsh secondary schools. We talk about entrepreneurs, entrepreneurship to 15 year olds and they're thinking about their careers. They're considering running their own businesses. So we need more educational process, maybe just get more people to actually do it. Let's talk about it, just actually literally hackathons, get them practically involved so they lose the fear of getting something started. If Silicon Valley is the capital, or at, you know, I call it the West, West Point of uh, capitalism, I think London is the capital of the world. Finding the right people with the right mindset that have the same goal and vision as you I think that's probably the most difficult thing. There are lots of challenges with growing your own business. Uh, clearly time, um, infrastructure. I've set this up myself. I'm kind of a one-man show. I do use a couple of agencies to help me out. Um, but largely it's me doing it all. I think first of all coming up with a business concept, once you do come up with a business concept that starts working, you could get the funding, the people that have the same passion as you, and then every day, you know, the buck stops at you. you know? um, well, when you grow a business in general, you, you face many challenges. You have to find the right audience, make sure your product resonates with that audience. Uh, you have to reach that audience, uh, especially at the beginning when you don't have much funds, you have to resort to different tactics, I think, to get known, to get exposure, to get traction at the beginning. <laughs>